Hello and Namaskar. A warm welcome to all our subscribers and viewers to Enviro Annotations Productions on YouTube. Let us dive into the headlines from our 21st August 2024 print issue. Government of India introduces new draft notification on EPR rules for non-ferrous metal scrap effective 1st April 2025. Government sets final deadline for declaring Exotic animals listed under Schedule 4 of the Wildlife Protection Act. Here are the hebdomadal air quality index data depicting crops from the period 15th August to 21st August 2024. AQA data from the number of cities reported during the period. This one represents the daily maximum AQI value. This graph depicts the Thursday to Wednesday hebdomadal average AQI of Delhi, Mumbai, Chennai and Kolkata. National Green Tribunal issues notice on alleged manufacturers of banned single-use plastics. All these manufacturers are allegedly located in Delhi. The National Green Tribunal Western Zone Bench order on Mumbai Coastal Road noise and air quality. National Green Tribunal Principal Bench issues a stay on closure and auction of poultry farm in Haryana. As you know, Environment Notations, India's first environmental weekly newspaper, is offering a very special discount, 40% off on our membership fee. So the membership fee of 5,000 rupees per annum now comes at 3,000 rupees for the entire year. Hurry up, the offer is valid only until 23rd August 2024. So, today is the last date. Coming back to the news headlines, Expert Appraisal Committee defers environmental clearance for Western Coalfields, Sharda Energy and Northern Coalfields. Clears Vedant Vasharis, rejects RRVUNL's exemption request. National Highway Authority of India gets expert appraisal committees not for NH 754K project affecting 88.6% agricultural land, 38 water bodies and 2,69,178 trees. Ministry of Ports, Shipping and Waterways must clarify an environmental clearance exemption request, says the expert appraisal committee. NABT accredited EIA consultant Aditi Environmental Services receives warning from the expert appraisal committee. Uttar Pradesh and Odisha lead in India's contaminated site count. India launches green truck transition program to replace diesel powered trucks with zero emission alternatives. Regulatory bodies respond to Green Court's directive on pharmaceutical induced environmental contamination. Indian Space Research Organization, ISRO, launches EOS-08 to boost environmental surveillance. Southern Coalfields Limited leads in accredited compensatory afforestation efforts. CPI report outlines path to zero emission trucking in India. Vrikyavandan, green twist led by Kota Police Officer Uma Vyas. Winners of IIT Madras ideas to impact national eco-innovative contest. Editorial, why was the appeal against CAQM withdrawn? Editorial, green seeds shown, the EnviroCare Green Rewards. Airtel sets sustainability benchmarks in business responsibility and sustainability reporting, BRSR, for the financial year 2023-24, amidst connectivity milestones. Understanding the Ministry's guidelines for accredited compensatory afforestation. Agreement signed for India's green ammonia export to Japan. That's all in this episode. Before I close, I must remind you to avail a paid subscription on our website. The link is given in the description. Hit us with your comments and feedback.